Grid supports grouping data by any column or summary value. In this video, you'll learn how to group rows by the summary values of a specific column. I'll start with a new WinForms project. I drop a group control. I open the Grid Smart tag and invoke the Data Source Configuration Wizard. I'll leave Database as the data source type and click on Next. I'll use an existing connection to the Northwind Sample Database. I'll select specific fields of the Orders table to supply data to the grid. Let it be Customer ID, Shipped Date, Ship Name, Freight, and Ship Country. And I'm done. I click Finish to close the Data Source Configuration Wizard. I switch to Code View. I add references to the following namespaces. Now, I'm going to create a Grid Summary Item object. I will then calculate the appropriate summary value for the Freight column. The code is placed in the Forms Load event so that it is triggered at runtime. I switch back to Design View. and add a button to the form. I'll set its caption to Sort by Summary. I double-click the button to create a handler for its click event. I'll add the following code to the event handler. This will first set freight as the summary column, then the group rows are sorted based on the maximum freight summary values in ascending order. I run the application to see the result. I'll group the rows by the ship country column. You'll notice that the group rows now display the max value summary of each group next to the group's title. I click on the sort by summary button and all the group rows are sorted in ascending order. For more information, please see the Extra Grids documentation. Thanks for watching, and thank you for choosing DevExpress.